Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm sharing with you all how to make a delicious smoked fish and fish dip. So if you'd like to see how to make this, keep watching. Please keep in mind you can use any type of fish to make this recipe. So I'm starting with my salmon that I'm going to go ahead and season with salt and pepper. Next goes on some annatto or uku powder, which is totally optional. Some garlic powder. onion powder, cumin powder, some cayenne pepper, and pimento pepper powder. Next goes on smoked paprika. Last ingredient, some green seasoning. The recipe can be found down below in the description box. We're going to massage all of those seasonings into the salmon. You want to massage it on both sides. Make sure that it's well massaged and it's seasoned properly. Now you want to cover and allow it to marinate for about minimum one hour. After it's finished marinating, we'll put it into our grill. Now I'm using my Traeger smoker for this. If you don't have one of these, you can use a regular grill or you can make this in your oven. It cooks until 145 degrees Fahrenheit the internal temperature now let's make the dip or the base for this dip so I started off with cream cheese and sour cream you want it to be at room temp and you want to go ahead and give that a good whip you want it to be nice and light and airy hence the reason why I whipped it so once it's to that consistency we're going to go ahead and flavor this with some celery salt some fish seasoning smoked paprika and we're going to give that a mix now celery salt does contain salt so you'd want to taste this base make sure the salt is where you would want it to be and then we're going to go in with some fresh herbs so we're going to go in with some chives some dill flat leaf parsley some celery and mix now I use chives if you can't find chives you can use scallions or green onions in Trinidad we call scallions scythe so when the fish is finished you want to check it you want to press on the fish if it starts to flake easily and it's nice and soft you know it's ready look how beautiful that color is on that fish so amazing So all we have to do now is go ahead and start flaking this fish and you can tell that it hasn't dried out it's so nice and moist depending on the temperature you set your grill to or your oven to it can take longer or it can finish faster I set mine to 220 degrees Fahrenheit and let it bake until it had an internal temperature of that 145 in went some lime pepper sauce and now I'm going to go in with that flaked fish now go ahead and give it a good mix once it's mixed in properly you want to taste and adjust your salt again and then it's ready to be served there's so much fish in this dip guys it was packed with salmon just look at the consistency you want a dippable consistency you don't want it to be too thick that your cracker would break when you go to pick up your dip. This freezes really well so you can make it in batches and freeze it for later use. I hope you guys enjoyed today's recipe. Make it, let me know down below what you think. Remember any type of fish you like can be used. Comment, let me know if you make it. I wanna hear from you. Thank you guys so much for joining me again in the kitchen today. Please remember to continue to stay safe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye everyone.